Well, good morning from a very sunny Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan. Here we have a really good boy, of course. This is a no surprise. We also have, see if I can do it right here, something else. Let me, first let me get the camera through these bars. Okay. So, over here, let's zoom way in. So something we don't see super often here in Sault Ste. Marie. Although I guess it's been more often <laughs> with the construction project. But here is the Great Republic. And they're offloading some kind of product here for the uh, lock construction. Now, I have to admit, you know, normally 99% plus of the time Argo is the brains of this operation. But today, I actually had the foresight of checking marine traffic before leaving the house. And I knew the Great Republic was here. And I could see they were tied up over there, so I figured they were unloading. So I brought my big camera, as you can tell, because I zoomed way in. I would not be able to zoom in nearly this much on my phone. But there isn't really anyone else around this morning. So, I wanted to see this. Well, again, it's not something that we see very often here. And I don't know what kind of product it is, of course, because as I have said, I have no inside knowledge and I have almost no knowledge of construction. So, but I imagine, because it's over there by the mix plant, it has something to do with making uh, concrete. I can't remember when it was, a couple weeks back. There was a load here by another ship. I can't remember which ship. And I don't know, that looks like, to me it looks like gravel. Whereas what the Great Republic is unloading. has a bit of brown to it. But it also could just be moist, I guess. I really don't know. I truly do not know. Uh, if you know, feel free to comment down below. <laughs> I do like to learn things. I'll pan here a little bit to the left. I bet this is the Hiawatha. And they've been uh, for a while now shuttling uh, workers and I'm guessing I can hear the sound of the lock gate opening I'm guessing they're just waiting for a lockdown so that count as the uh, that's stretching it. I say, is that a twofer? But the freighter is not moving, and the tour boat it's not a freighter. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> now, as I'm looking around here, you know, so much of this construction project—well, I guess all of it, really has been very gradual for me, because I walk this every day. And I'm trying to look around and remember how it all used to look. <laughs> you know, like that mix plant wasn't, that mix plant wasn't really there. Um, those buildings weren't there. 
You know, I guess one's the building, the other one might just be one of those, uh, oh, they have a name. It's like an office on wheels. God, what are those called? I don't know. Oh, what are we doing over here? Sounds like sirens across the river. Oh. I saw the hook and I was like, what are we picking up? But maybe they just were setting something down. Right, let's take a peek. I looked at marine traffic. I didn't see anyone Ooh. this way, but it's going to be really bright looking into the sun here. Yep, it's really bright. Can't see a thing, can we? Just bright light. I'm going to pan this way. We've got a nice head-on shot here. The, I'm pretty sure is the Hiawatha. Ooh. They make their way into the lock. In the Great Republic. Unloading, which is thousands of tons. I'm sure of some mystery product. Over there. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, let me get my camera back out of here. We're back on the way. So I never did mention the date. Today is the 15th of May, Wednesday, the 15th of May. I got to be better about that. I was pretty good for a while and then I've been being lax again. But it's 15th of May and we are going to, oh, just a second. There we go. <laughs> finish up this walk and uh, proceed with the food and coffee. I know he's excited about the food. You can even see the hustle in his ears there. <laughs> All right. Have a good one. We will be back.